something happening here But what it is ain't exactly clear There's a man with a gun over there Telling me I got to beware I think it's time we stop Children, what's that sound? Everybody look what's going down I call this piece advertising Quality, values, style, service, selection, convenience, economy, savings, performance, experience, hospitality, low rates, friendly service, name brands, easy terms, affordable prices, money back guarantee, free installation. <laughs> free admission, free appraisal, free alterations, free delivery, free estimates, free home trial, and free parking. No cash, no problem. <laughs> No kidding, no fuss, no must, no risk, no obligation, no red tape, no hidden charges, no down payment, no entry fee, no purchase necessary, no one will call on you, no payments or interest till December, and no parking. <laughs> Limited time only though, so act now, order today, send no money, offer good while supplies last, two to a customer, each item sold separately, batteries not included, mileage may vary. <laughs> All sales are final, allow six weeks for delivery, some items not available, some assembly required, some restrictions may apply. <laughs> Shop by mail, order by phone, try it in your home, get one for your car. All entries become our property, employees not eligible, entry fees not refundable, local restrictions apply, void where prohibited except in Indiana. <laughs> So come on in. Come on in for a free demonstration and a free consultation with our friendly professional staff. Our courteous and knowledgeable sales representatives will help you make a selection that's just right for you and just right for your budget. And say, don't forget to pick up your free gift. A classic, deluxe, custom, designer, luxury, prestige, high-quality, premium, select, gourmet pocket flashlight. And... And if you act now, we'll include an extra added free complimentary bonus gift, a classic, deluxe, custom, designer, luxury, prestige, high-quality, premium, select, gourmet, leather-style wallet with detachable keychain and a pencil holder. It's our way of saying thank you. And if you're not completely satisfied, you pay nothing. Simply return the unused portion for a full refund. No questions asked. It's our way of saying thank you. Keep your free gift. Actually, it's our way of saying, bend over just a little further and let us stick this big dick into your ass a little bit deeper. Well, you know, whenever you're exposed to advertising in this country, you realize all over again that America's leading industry is still the manufacture, distribution, packaging, and marketing of bullshit. <laughs> High-quality bullshit. World-class designer bullshit, to be sure. Hospital-tested, clinically proven bullshit. But bullshit nonetheless. And it always amuses me that so many people seem to think that bullshit only comes from certain sources. You know, advertising, politicians, salesmen. Not true. Bullshit is everywhere. Bullshit is rampant. Parents are full of shit. Teachers are full of shit. Clergymen are full of shit. Law enforcement people are full of shit. The entire country is completely full of shit. In fact, this country was founded by a group of slave owners who told us that all men are created equal. That is what's known as being stunningly, stunningly full of shit. And you know, I think... And I think people show their ignorance when they say they want politicians to be honest. What are these people talking about? If honesty were suddenly introduced into politics, it would throw everything off. The whole system would collapse. And I think deep down the American people know that. The American people like their bullshit out front, where they can get a good strong whiff of it. That's why they re-elected Clinton. Listen. Clinton might be full of shit, but he lets you know it. <laughs> Dole tried to hide it. I'm an honest man. Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. 
People don't believe that shit. Clinton said, hi, I'm full of shit, and how do you like that? And the people said, at least he's honest. At least he's honest about being full of shit. It's like the business world. All businessmen are completely full of shit. Just the worst kind of people you could ever want to run into. Businessmen. And the proof of it is, they don't even trust each other. They don't trust each other. When a businessman is negotiating a deal, the first thing he does is to automatically assume that the other guy is a complete lying prick who's trying to fuck him on the deal. So he has to do everything he can to fuck the other guy a little bit harder and a little bit faster. And then, when it comes to dealing with customers, that's when you get the big smile. That's when you get the big smile. Businessman always has that big smile on his face as he carefully positions himself directly behind the customer and unzips his pants and services the account. We specialize in customer service. You heard that? Now you know what it means. Whoever coined the phrase, let the buyer beware, was probably bleeding from the asshole. Yeah. Then you have advertising. Advertising is the businessman's cheaply dressed $2 blowjob. Advertising sells you things you don't need and can't afford that are overpriced and don't work. And they do it by exploiting your fears and insecurities. And if you don't have any, they'll be glad to give you a few by showing you a nice picture of a woman with big tits. That's the essence of advertising. Big tits. Threateningly big tits. And speaking of big tits, what about show business? Show business, completely dishonest, corrupt, and full of shit but in a nice way. <laughs> Plenty of expensive drugs and perverted sex. If you're gonna be full of shit, might as well enjoy your work. <laughs> then you have the media. Not just the news media, let's include them all. The media are almost literally exploding with bullshit <laughs> because they're located right at the crossroads of all the other bullshit. The media are made up of equal parts, advertising, politics, business, public relations, and show business. These people are sitting right at bullshit junction. 